I'm Tony Northrup. And I'm Chelsea for the second time. And today our portfolio review is brought to you by Squarespace. Uh, this is our first live one. And Squarespace is the all-in-one platform for creating fast, easy portfolio of a professional website. And if you want 10% off, go to squarespace.com slash counting and put on the coupon code. Portfolio. Yeah. yeah. So if you see these awesome portfolios and you get a little bit jealous, squarespace.com slash Tony and set yourself up a new portfolio free for 14 days. And then that coupon code portfolio is good for 10% off. Right. If you decide to sign up, but there's no credit card or anything. And if you want to be a part of this live broadcast, you can comment on YouTube, which people have been doing. I've been watching you. And thanks to you, I knew that we weren't live. Or you can comment on Twitter, hashtag Tony Chelsea. Uh, and we'll be checking our Twitter feed as well. All right. Well, let's get started with Erki Alvinmod's portfolio. He's one of our favorite people. Yeah, and this is the third time we've looked, we've, third time we've looked at his website. Uh, we reviewed it once, and then we did one year review, and then he continues to tweak it, which is how life works, right? You get some feedback, you don't get mad, you accept you it, mad. and you do a rev. And every successful person in life takes feedback, constructive criticism, and they, it, applies it. they deny it, and then they get They angry. write an angry YouTube comment, like, no, you are stupid, and I will unsubscribe. They do the opposite. No. Okay. We accept <laughs> feedback, and that's what Eric D is great at. And so we'll probably give him some more feedback here. Um, but right away, I like his website. He I like, like his big pictures. Yeah, immersive, full screen. Look, he's got the book now. What's his book now? His dog yeah, has really clean this. teeth. So why would he? Spyro I? sold me. Shira. Shiro. I thought it was, that's like a, a cartoon Spyro, dragon. Yeah. <laughs> you can oh. understand the confusion. So Oh, okay. So oh, great. that's clever. It was a pet picture and I clicked the book and it took me to his page. He's got a really wow, sophisticated nerd. website. Uh, this is one of the most sophisticated portfolios I've ever seen with the text, the moving text over this the pictures. It's cute, really man. nice. But, can you guys hear us now? Let me know on YouTube. Okay, so Eric's website has pricing and his why location. Hire me? I want to know why we should hire him. Okay. Today he told me that Sweden has like a billion likes or something. That's not the exact number, but likes on Facebook. No, he said that Sweden has like sixty thousand likes or something like that. Oh, likes! He loves I thought you Sweden. meant likes like this. No, <laughs> like likes. It's pretty petty if Facebook is competing on the number of likes they have, or Sweden is competing All on Facebook likes. Oh, good. The glitch likes. is fixed. Okay, good. Thanks, guys. Thank Thanks you for guys. sticking with us. That was awesome. Um, so, Eric, you have a lot of... There's a lot of words here. I don't know too many people who would read through all this. What I would do is I would boil it down to a few sentences, maybe even just bullet points. Eric is literally one of my favorite people in the world, but I still can't read that. <laughs> too long. All right. What else? Why this? Why is it? Oh, okay. This is his contact. Agreed. So he's got a, a form here. Oh, look at um, that. He's so and fancy. he's got a little email link, so you can fill out the form, or you can just Let's press it. Oh no! Wait, that looks like it's to share it. Oh. Um, how do you? I think you just have to fill out. Uh, I like to be able to just click a link and email you. Yeah, me too. Though he does have a phone number, which is a start, but that's a crazy looking phone number. Nobody. That's not a phone number. That's that's not the right number of numbers. Who being ethnocentric Americans in an ironic way. What? <laughs> okay, so his family picture. And, you know, as I recall, the first time we looked at his website, we gave him a little feedback that uh, the wedding section had some redundant pictures. Um, you know how to say wedding in Swedish? Um, Bruja. Wedding. No, that's not right. Billy Silver so. said our audio is a tad tacky. I don't... We are a tad tacky. I'm tacky. Okay. Oh, I'll man. admit it. It worked. Uh, let's see. Bull up. All right. Oh. Um, all right, so that's kind of nice. He has the pictures and the pricing all on one page. Oh, great wedding pictures, too. Yeah, that's beautiful. Okay, so you can get the thumbnails just by hovering over it. That's, that's very cool. Um, wow, he really narrowed it down. He's got five pictures on there. 
I feel okay about that. How do you feel about five pictures? Um, well, they look really good, so I'm okay with it. Yeah, I think so too. I think you just need to be happy with those five pictures. I, I wouldn't hate seeing a little retouching on that particular photo, but the rest of them look absolutely perfect. That's a stunning first example. That picture is perfect. That's a great composition. All right, what else? This portfolio. Yeah, it's maybe it's a translation issue. It's odd that he has these different categories and he has a different portfolio. All right, so these are basically thumbnails. I think this is an overall summary. So this includes the pictures from the other categories. I don't know. I guess it, it, it seems a bit redundant. Some of these pictures are the same and some are different. I like it because it's kind of the best up. How many are on this page? Well, no, wait. He's, then he's got... Oh, he has some redundant angles in here. Yeah, I think this is just... Okay. Yeah, this is redundant because I can go to wedding here and I see six pictures and I go to okay. wedding here. I guess I would just remove that portfolio the link. Second. So that's really easy. Yeah. Uh, so your homework, remove that portfolio link and uh, pare down that text sum where you tell us about yourself. Yeah. Pare down all the text, just fewer words in general, assuming that the Swedes, your target audience, have the same ADD problem that we Americans do. They might not. They seem better than me. You know, the Swedes are better than Americans. <laughs> I wouldn't say that. You're afraid of alienating our American fans? No. I'm afraid that you're forgetting that we have Tex-Mex. Okay. Now we are moving on to Hayden Jones. This site was created by Wix.com. Create your own for free. Why gotta let Wix.com advertise on your page like that? Create a Wix site. Yeah, that's a big ghetto. I could you think of a place where he could get rid of that Wix.com? Look at this. Who wouldn't do graffiti on something like that? Kids oh, these days. You know no. what I mean? And it's a bit confusing. Like you have a background picture here that oh. just barely peeks through. Um, yeah, it's a bit maybe it'll crazy. be more prominent. Uh, oh, there it is. Oh, so now we're seeing the background picture. Okay. Wow, a 19-year-old photographer in Australia. This is a great amount of text. I just wish you had a yeah. picture of yourself here. How do you know that's not him? <laughs> Somewhere in there. He's a very tall gentleman. <laughs> tall and slender. <laughs> Aviation photos, okay. That's an, an, a category we haven't seen in a portfolio before. I love airplanes too, though. I'm an Air Force brat. Though I'll admit that I never got into the like commercial. commercial. I was always into like F fours and F fifteens and SR seventy ones and XB seventeens. I'm really turning on some airplane nerds out there I know, right you now. You know what? I don't. I'd rather not hear about it. <laughs> what else? Wait, not even the XB seventeen. Nope. There's a Mach three bomber, Chelsea. I don't even know what you, these words. Uh, you get we have been here. Is that? Uh. It's 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 a uh, Lucerne, Switzerland, right? It's pretty and it's on water. <laughs> Great That's pictures. A beautiful picture, yeah. The background, I do love his Eiffel Tower picture, but it's really distracting as a background. I'd prefer like solid white or solid black. Yeah, I totally it's, agree it's with really that. It's really fighting with your pictures, and your pictures are really beautiful, by the way. These are and your great watermark, pictures. I. I'm sorry. You need to chill out with that watermark. Yeah, I don't Just like the watermark. Just go simple. It's fighting with your images. You're a great photographer, um, but it's competing. It's a okay to not have a watermark, but if you're going to use a watermark, that that's too much. And like the beveling and stuff on the text is kind of out of style nowadays. It's, yeah. It, we go very simple. Some people are still getting repeat sound. Some people said that they love your vest so much and they want to wear it. Some people are Swedish. These are the comments we're getting. Is anyone on Twitter? No, it doesn't seem like anybody's tweeting no, us, but I, I don't think sad. kids these days are using Twitter anymore. <laughs> <laughs> some people are getting repeated sound and some aren't. I don't even know how to explain that. Um, maybe the person is watching the, maybe they started back from the beginning. 
Blue Max 413. No, he's been here the whole time. Well, he said he reloaded. Oh. Huh. Hmm. No receipt here, though, the one before that. So one okay. of the things you want to avoid is, is just having a category for one picture. I think that's a cool macro picture, but there's nothing else in there. It's just oh, that one yeah. picture. So you don't want to lead somebody, you know, have somebody go through the process of clicking a link uh, and then see nothing. But let's check out his panoramas. Well, that's the one thing I really like about having a portfolio. Even if you're not looking to be hired, it's a great exercise because he wants to take macro pictures, obviously, but he only has one. So go out there and take more macro pictures, build up your category, and then post it. Beautiful shot. And you know what I love about it? That little moon up there. How cute that is that? Little moon. A real moon. So because we're live, I'll encourage you to provide feedback about the portfolios that yeah. we're reviewing. And then once we get through the portfolio, we'll read your feedback and you can kind of give your own voice and your own thoughts to it. Yeah. Um, this, you know, we got to level that, right? Do we? It's just a hair off. You know, the, especially with the panorama. You know, the earth isn't perfectly flat, right? Um. Well, I understand it's a flat disc. It's a sphere. Uh, I don't think there's any evidence for that. People look sad. Okay. Let's see. Okay, so this was loading for a second. Let's see if we can see it. We can pan around here. Whoa! Oh, my goodness. This is the coolest 19-year-old. Like Man, I was so lame when I was 19 compared to this kid. I wasn't. I was just, but like slightly cooler than this kid. <laughs> you laugh like you don't believe it. Oh my god. I was just running backups for a healthcare company trying to pay for college. That's very cool. Uh, that is the top of the Eiffel Tower. Oh my god, this kid has been everywhere. Beautiful, nicely done. So you have photographs and panoramas here. What I would do is I would take these panorama categories and combine them under photographs. No need for that extra menu. Um, or better yet, drop both the photographs and panoramas top level menus and have menus for aviation, landscapes, and uh, panoramas. And then even if you want 360 yeah. panoramas. Um, no need to have this two level menu here. There aren't enough to bother with the second level. Check out his contact page. We want to see that he has his email address. The M got scrolled to the next line, which is too bad. But otherwise, it's okay. And we need to see a picture of you, Hayden. Otherwise, you're looking good. I'm laughing at people's comments. T-Bones Tech said the Earth looks like a CD. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I am not a scientist, but that's the way I understand it. Where did you guys go to school? <laughs> um... Those panels are pretty yeah, sweet. They, they really are. are yeah. They're really cool. And uh, Andy Sniff says, hey, Tony and Chelsea. So, hey, Andy, what's up? How are you living? Um, Eric suggested to Blue Max that you push the live button to get live. Mm -hmm. So that would apply to anybody else who's still watching the beginning of the feed where we completely screwed up the audio. Yeah. <laughs> Portraits by Susie. I have Susie. seen a website before, but I don't think we've actually reviewed it. I like that kid who was in, like, the graffiti. It was like... Usually it's like 18-year-old uh, boys who do the graffiti look, but that was like a four-year-old kid. Oh. You can't go, you can't I know, it. that's a total no-no. We mm. are control freaks. Everybody in the modern world wants to be able to control their experience. And, and you're taking this on the slideshow, but I can't slow it down or speed it up. So you definitely want to be able to provide control. Um, but I love these pictures, and that's why I want to be able to go back. I want to be able to say, oh, hey, I love this picture. Let's dig in a little deeper. You're so talented, These are Susie. all great shots. Um, but we just can't explore them well enough, so let's see if there's something that allows us to go into a little more detail. That's a great shot. I love the leaves. I feel like they had to gather the leaves and very carefully spread them out. I love that little sweater vest. There's a lot of pictures, uh, but we have thumbnails here. So we have, we, we could do with about half those pictures. Yeah, I could narrow it down. Okay. So it's a little confusing that the user interface just changed. <laughs> <laughs> that fake dog is killing me. I, this is really cute. I, I would crop out that negative space above her, but... <laughs> <laughs> I've not seen that one. I thought I'd seen all the kids' pictures, but that's cute. That was a great picture. Oh, that's a great shot. These are 
some of the best kids' pictures I've ever seen. Yeah, they're really interesting too. Sometimes they get so boring when people just have the same backdrops. Like, oh, here's the kid with the graffiti, loading graffiti kid. Oh my gosh, it's <laughs> eating the baby. I love that. You don't see enough monsters eating babies in, in children photography. How many cameras have you guys set up? Great job. Four. Four? Four and two webcams. Four and two webcams. We have... Yeah, plus the two screencasts. Plus the two screencasts. So it's basically a six camera shoot here. Wow. We go hardcore. We go a little deep. Oh, That's what a, a really cute shot. Great. Look at that kid showing off. My parents love each other. <laughs> I'm jealous of that kid. <laughs> <laughs> we have a dog. This is like braggy kid photography. Look at all the leaves we have. <laughs> what show offs? Such show offs. <laughs> Look at my bow and my hair. You know, everyone's so happy, Susie. How'd you do it? Yeah, these are great pictures. There are a lot of Yeah, this of is pictures. a really solid portfolio. Uh, everything looks really great. Again, this is a lot of pictures, but uh, you know what? I'm not flipping through. Usually I flip through and I think... Um, Hey, this is too many pictures. This picture doesn't isn't as solid Someone made as a the good other point ones. Point that the pictures load pretty slow. Is that us or is that Sims? Um, that baby's cute, man. I, I'm not going to say it's us because we have a solid wireless connection now, and uh, I think yeah, she she needs to compress the pictures more because that is loading slowly. I think these were loaded before, so they're cached, but. Look at this guy. My family! <laughs> and even the baby's like, yeah! How did they get the baby's arms out? Well, I'm That's impressed, Susie. These are, baby. are great pictures. Uh, couples. We won't spend too much longer on our pictures because they're, they're awesome, but... Great shot. Leading lines. Beautiful lighting. Almost looks like a studio shot. So... Susie, I think your hosting provider, some hosting providers will recompress your pictures to make sure they load quickly. And I think yours is not doing that. So you need to go through and save your pictures at like a 50% compression ratio. Compress it way more than you already have. And I know it hurts to compromise the image quality, but it's more important to have it load fairly quickly. Um, so here's one web design no-no. About gets underlined, makes me think it's a link. I'm clicking it, it does nothing. Meet Susie. I we also have, to... like, Susie. do you feel like we need four different about menu things? I think it'd be nice if there was just one about and it gave us, you know, about her and some pricing. Where's Susie? I want to meet you, Susie. Is she the first one? Oh. Uh, yeah, that's not clear. What to expect. Yeah, once again, that picture's looking kind of slow. Um, we've seen some of these pictures before. I don't know that you have to cram your portfolio in all of these, though it is nice to include one picture, maybe something that takes up a smaller portion of the screen. Mm -hmm. uh, showcase your heart. Showcase your heart? What does that mean? All right, so there are her prices. Was that, did it just say prices, or would that showcase your heart? This was prices, but I am curious about showcase your heart. So let's see. Oh, okay. Um, it's just like getting prints, basically. Um, so somebody asked what the recommended file size is. Um, Honda's best, <laughs> and I would say keep it under a hundred kilobit. Um, above that, it's going to take a little while. Yeah. But you know, it, it's a compromise. I know. Most Nero, people won't notice little compression artifacts, but they will notice that your page loads slow. Nero says, let me guess, Squarespace does compress your pictures, doesn't it? Smart ass. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, does it? Um, yeah, it must. Justin says it must. I, don't, I would think. 
I, I don't know either, but you're right. Most of know. them would. And this is actually a really cool display. I've not seen this before. She's um, kind of photoshopped in pictures so that you can imagine what they look like in your environment. Yeah, that's and, cool. And that's that's a cool thing to do. And I've, uh, I've really not seen this before. So Susie's got it going what was on. This? this was Showcase Your Heart. That is clever. I like being able to visualize this. And I, I also like the idea of having the same picture of me six times on our wall. <laughs> or, and then two little smaller you pictures of me. You are a narcissist. You know what? I know beauty when I see it. And I am you know beautiful what? It, in every single my, way. One, my advice to Susie would be for that category, showcase your heart. Just wasn't very clear. I mean, I'm a curious person and I'm reviewing your portfolio. So I wanted to see what that was about. But I would just say like, I don't know, prints or canvases or wall art or something like that. And you know what we want for the contact page? We want to see your email address. Oh, yeah, I want to see that. And a link to click to send you an email. And it's okay like to have a form, people, too. I like when people have their picture at the contact page. Yeah. Because then I feel like I know who I'm contacting. Ooh, ask what color the sky was. What color the sky was? Oh, I see. Um, client galleries does nothing. I would think it would have popped up a... Okay, so I think we found a bug. <laughs> so your RSS feed here doesn't work. Um, this is cool. She has this, I like this little pull up in the left. Yeah, that is cool. So, Susie, Susie your you homework. Pare down that about menu a little bit. Pare it down. Um, I, I want to tell you to use fewer pictures in your portfolio, but they were also awesome, don't you think? They were really I good. I didn't see but... any that I didn't think were up to par. No, they were all good. I still, I don't know. I 15 tops. I think less is more. 10 still. to 15, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And you had a couple technical glitches. Client galleries doesn't seem to do anything. Subscribe is broken. So obviously we want to fix those, but I, I love the design of it. Simple, non-distracting. Yeah. Lots of great elements. I think that the design of her page is good for the type of clients that she's going to get. She, she really knows her markets, families. Tony is practically perfect in every way. Come on, guys. This is going to go to his head. Um, <laughs> Justin's laughing. I think he's making fun of me wanting eight pictures of myself on the wall. <laughs> right. Okay, so this is RC photography. Okay. RCP. You and down with RCP? You know me. Uh, <laughs> all right. <laughs> That's silly. I love this Charlie's Angels photo here. Um, I so far too many pictures on this first page. I, I want to see the the processing toned down on all of these, like ten percent, don't you think? Ten um, percent, like fifty percent. Yeah, there's a lot going on. You yeah, don't think this that's is a, a nice picture? Process. I like that. That's prominent. This yeah, is a nice picture. Yeah. Um, oh, good. There seems to be plenty of variety. I, I guess it's just same a matter model, of taste. Same like, shoot. Yeah. Yeah. So you don't want a lot of the same model. This girl with the checkered shirt and the blonde hair. Just choose the best picture. Um, yeah, you're paring it down anyway. So uh, okay. So it opens up to the portrait space. Right, let's let's check out landscapes. Chris Greenwood in the house. Oh, good. Okay, so some of these are cool. Uh, hydroplanes? Hydroplanes. Whoa! <laughs> Why don't we do this? Yeah, we need one of these. Yeah, we need it. How much do these for cost? For reasons. They can't be more than a couple hundred bucks, right? Can you imagine if we took that on the river and just like blew everyone away. All right. We're getting distracted, but this is a lot of pictures. With the, uh oh, what's this? Ah, um, so this is downright scary. I feel like I've broken into some place. I uh, like it. I'm just gonna try password. What's his dog's name? Oh. <laughs> Fido? No. Um, admin. Damn it. Um, I've watched Sorry. lots of movies about hackers, and that usually works. You've watched lots of movies. You are a specialist on web security. 
<laughs> and you always tell me that my passwords are bad. Yeah, your passwords are terrible. I don't know what Marabou oh, is, scary. and you click it, and something scary comes up. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? But good work not having an obvious password. I'm just going to go back and try one, two, three, four. No, nothing. Okay. And there's also no prompt to go back. Like, I know Alt left goes back. Otherwise, I would have just been lost there, and I never would have been able to use my computer again. I didn't know that. What's this logo down here? Powered by Squarespace. Squarespace. Wow. Well, uh, we should I, send, I already like this portfolio better. If people use Squarespace, we should send them one of our jelly beans. <laughs> yeah. We, we're also drinking some jelly beans here. Is it a good year? Mm, excellent year, mm. yeah. Especially the bubble gum from that year was... <laughs> the bubble gum from that year was excellent. Magnifique. So there's a picture of himself. He tells us where he is. That's great. Contact me at a separate page. And yes, he's got his email right there. That's very nice. Okay. Rick Cobe. Uh, so... What? So what? Rick does not have a pricing page, which to me means he's not, he's not, working. not trying to be a photographer, a professional photographer, but yeah. he does have good portraits. And because he leads with the portraits, you think somebody might stumble across it one hire him. You might as well have a pricing page up there, right? Yeah, that's true. I might... I like these. I might want some of these for me, you know? Yeah. So we did suggest paring this down a little bit, but I think his body of work here is coming along. Yeah. Um, but at this point, I'm definitely reading this as an amateur page because I don't think there are too many hydroplane drivers that are looking for photographers. You didn't even know about but them. But he's putting up something that he loves. Uh, so that's why I'm going to call it an, an enthusiast page. Um, okay. But if you do decide you want to do some work, put up uh, the pricing. Uh-oh. Oh, there we go. Yeah, wait. Okay. Someone said the password might be hydroplane one two three four. <laughs> yeah, hackers. Where hackers was, um, they had the little pie in like the lower right corner, the pie symbol, and you would click the pie symbol, and then you could hack into like the underworld. I've seen it. I don't know what um, you're saying, but it sounds cool. All right. No, sorry. It's not. Stop trying to hack a site. What if we did and there was something personal there, like <laughs> like him, like, I don't know, hugging his favorite stuffed animal or something embarrassing like that. Oh, thank you for the jelly beans, Rudy. We always appreciate people sending us candy. It doesn't I happen love that. candy. Ever happened, no, right? no, it's not. Erky sent us candy. Thank you, Erky. Oh, yeah. He sent us Swedish candy, <clears throat> alcohol, um, an assortment of jam, and Swedish crackers, and it was... Probably the best day of my life. Um, it was the day Erky sent us that stuff when Madeline was born. Our wedding. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty much the order. Remember the time somebody gave us a gift card to Starbucks? That was awesome. Yeah. I'd probably slot that right above Madeline being born. You have to. <laughs> Starbucks is really good. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So, Rootfish Photography. This is we're re reviewing his. Portfolio it already course. looks better. Took us his feedback Rudy, again. you're on a roll, Rudy. How, how do you think he made such vast improvements to his He took our advice. <laughs> da, 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 da. He went to Squarespace. Before the design wasn't that great, but he went to what? my favorite portfolio provider, the one we both use for our portfolio. Squarespace, the all-in-one platform for creating a fast and easy portfolio or professional website. Yeah, you don't have to be some hacker nerd to set it up. Yeah. You just drag your photos in. You can choose from like a dozen different, just gorgeous designs, and they will all just work. They have twenty four seven support, which I haven't had to use luckily, but it's there. <laughs> I had to use it because I'm not as technically savvy as you. I you contacted can't the Kevlar layer, and they wrote back to me immediately. And instead of like asking me questions or anything, they just fixed it for me. They're like, we went ahead and just fixed it. No way, really? Yeah, they just took care of it. Even Don't though it was you... my dumb user error. They didn't charge me or anything like that. They just fixed it. Anyway, it was a, a great experience. And the website interface is the best I've ever seen as far as setting it up. I love that they just fixed it for you. What's worse than when you tell them your problem and then they they like have some really stupid suggestions? Or like, they is you your FAQ. computer on? Yeah. And you're you, like, oh. did you turn it off and on again? Yeah. That's cool. I love my Squarespace. I have to... Beef it up. It, they're actually inspiring me. I've yeah. Gotta, you know, do, change it. It's fun, too. I kind of lose time, like track of time. It's kind of fun to change templates and add to it and move around your pictures. But So whether you're a pr 
pro or an amateur, go to squarespace.com slash Tony and sign up for a free 14 day trial, no credit card required. And then if you decide to continue the service, if you'd like it, it's fun to set up anyway. Yeah. If you like it, it's a good use exercise. the coupon code portfolio, portfolio. For 10% off. Yeah, we're afraid we cut out there for a little bit, and you might have missed some of our Squarespace plug. Everybody's like, yes! There's a god! Victor! <laughs> All right, you get it. If you want a website, whether it's a portfolio or something else, go to squarespace.com slash Tony. Sign up. It's free for 14 days. No credit card required. And then you can put in the coupon code <laughs> portfolio if you decide to continue. Rudy did that. Rudy! And look how much better his website Rudy. looks than before. before. Remember the Cosby show? Rudy! <laughs> <laughs> Justin, you love the Cosbys, right? Oh, yeah. bop, ba jello. Sorry, let's get back to this. So Rudy's taken a, a different stance in that um, you're first greeted with kind of a banner here and then text, and then you see, I am raw. I don't, I guess we should just Join explore. Join the movement. I want to. Yeah. Okay, he's got a picture of himself. Life is his passion. I've been loving on Rudy 24-7. <laughs> How dare you. <laughs> Let's go. Wait, is this it? Do we have to go back to the other part? Uh, maybe. I don't know. It seems like we got taken somewhere else. What Eric, you said, guys, there was a send button right below the booking form. Lay off the jelly beans, will ya? What's that supposed to mean? Lay off the jelly beans. Worst advice of the night. So this is his monochrome category. If we come up here, we see his different categories. <gasps> jelly beans. He's on a roll. Yeah, this is crazy. What's happening? He loves jelly beans too, I guess. I know. Uh, okay. So wait. What was this category? Jelly Belly? This category is motorcycles, so... That's a jelly bean motorcycle. Oh, it's the bean machine. It's the bean machine. All right, he, that's good. There's something, it's something going he's on. passionate about. It's like his full-time job is jelly beans. Jelly beans and motorcycles. I, I've never known anybody who combined those two loves. Artsy fartsy. <laughs> artsy fartsy. Also, my two loves. Oh, okay. So this is artsy fartsy, and every page has jelly beans. I feel like I'm... <laughs> in the White House in the 80s for some reason. Wait, what's that mean? Something motor for old people. With clue me in. <laughs> what's it? What happened? I, no, it's not going to be... I don't freaking like jelly beans. I, I feel like <laughs> this category it's is missing weird. jelly beans. Um, but I like the layout of it and see if we can zoom right in here. What if it's like, where's Waldo and there's actually a jelly bean in every picture? It's like, oh, there it is! <laughs> he put it in the tree! Something um, to consider. This might actually require less JPEG compression. It, it looks like it's been scaled up a little bit. If you squint, it looks great. See, this looks much better. The other one uh, might have been a little bit of a overcompressed or small. Okay, photo shoots. Oh, the jelly bean. See? <laughs> Factory. Oh, I... oh my god, there's John <laughs> Reagan. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! What's happening? That's like... That's good, man. Yeah, that man really did a lot for Jelly Bean, so I think we should all take a moment to thank him I'm gonna for take the a work. And just... <laughs> right, so he likes Nissans. Rudy's People like. He likes their Z's. Rudy's a man of mystery. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Is it about Jelly Beans? <laughs> <laughs> that would be wonderful. Rudy. Oh, he bought a six. Congrats, that's nice. Z's, motorcycles, and jelly beans. I feel like we know Rudy pretty. Oh, oh! Thank you. Thank you, Rudy. Rudy, we love you too. And thank you for the jelly beans. I want to eat the jelly beans so badly, but I know I chew like a monster. <laughs> Can't. Um. Gary Thurman. Okay, we didn't get any uh, feedback on. Nobody cares about Rudy. the jelly beans. Has everything died? Are we still? I'm showing the stream status is good, but I my comments. One are, person disliked our, our video. <laughs> well, we did oh have some God. crazy echoing going on. It's a thumbs down. I'd like to give them a finger up, but I shouldn't say which one. Should I? <laughs> I stopped getting comments for some reason, but YouTube is showing me it's having a good stream. Maybe people just got overwhelmed by the jelly beans. 
Okay, so I refresh and I can see the comments now. So let's see what people are saying. What are people saying? Let's get it. Mm. Whoa, Chelsea's so cool. I want to be her when I grow up. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Sorry, we're reading your comments now, which I know is not especially exciting this isn't stuff. This is interesting for you. Froze, but back again. Someone said he never said Jello on TV. Let's plug Jelly Space. You guys are crazy. Another freeze. Someone needs more bandwidth. Someone needs a new Justin. <laughs> <laughs> Justin, how do you feel about that? I feel great about it. You feel great? Positive <laughs> <Lots of> reinforcement. <laughs> what, are you, what are we doing now? Okay. Uh, we'll turn through a couple more portfolios. This is uh, Gary Thurman. Beautiful pictures. Um, it looks like everybody I like all these left. pictures, not too many. Hmm. Well, okay. It looks like we're still broadcasting. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> so they want to know how long we're going to be live for. We're going to do one or two more portfolios and cut it? Yeah, I think we'll do one more it's after like this and then we'll minutes. call it. So. Okay. So these are Gary's portraits. Gary. And I feel like they're all solid. Um, I wouldn't... Sometimes I see too much post-processing. I wouldn't mind seeing a tad more processing on the skin of these young ladies. Oh, they're going to go there. Do you think? Um, yeah, I, I don't want to get too personal on any individual, but, you know, I think nowadays we expect just a little bit of touching up. Any sort of uh, changes in the skin tone are really okay. great to brush out. These are Gary's seascapes. Looks great. You can scroll through. It's clean. So far, not too many pictures. That's beautiful. Yeah, the quantity of pictures is great. The user interface is great. It fills the screen. Uh, these are all great shots. Yeah, none of those stand out as being bad. Landscapes. Great shot. Beautiful clouds. Gorgeous sunset. Wow. Oh, I like that one. Oh, you're really cruising. <laughs> Oh, that was nice. Ooh. Oh, Whoa. beautiful. There you go. Yeah. It's just beautiful. I mean, what are we supposed to do? Yeah. All these shots are perfect. I, I don't have anything negative to say at all. I think these are all great. Gorgeous waterfalls. Long exposures. Nice feathery water. Perfect. I love to Heavy. see that water nice and bright and white. These are beautiful. Gary Thurman. You oh. won me over today, Look Gary. those goddards. You know what? Lead with that. Lead with it, Gary. Yeah. Start with your best picture, and that's your best picture. End with your second best. About me. All right. Picture of himself. I think he looked at our checklist, which is at yes, sdp.io slash portfolio Here. checklist. Yeah, go through that and then submit your portfolio to us by sending me an email at tony at northrop.org. And if you're a reader of our book, you'll get top priority. Yeah, you get top priority. We like to do it like that. Um, Great shot. And Gary's look, he's cool. using a, a rebel because you don't need a big camera to do awesome pictures. I can tell Gary's a, a nice guy. Yeah. Uh, not too many words. You nailed it. You have your email address there. You get a hundred. You get a check plus plus, Gary. Let's send him a jelly bean. <laughs> you get a jelly bean. Thanks so much for joining us. Thank you for being That's it. patient. Thank you for on being our patient. Second live broadcast. We're still working through lots of technical, technical issues. Technical difficulties. It is complex. And thank you, Squarespace, for sponsoring all of this. Yeah, thank you. Uh, stay tuned and subscribe for future updates. Thanks so much. Thanks. Goodbye.